Hi everybody, it's Dr. Megan Picot from Jairsvillebent and Polly.com. This is Buddy, he's about an 11 year old indoor cat. He lives in a house with another cat who he doesn't really get along with and his owners noticed this swelling on the side of his face. So if you notice the left side of his face looks normal and then the right side of his face has this big bulging um, mass on the side of it. It's warm and he's got a fever, so this is most likely an abscess. So for cats, and for whatever reason, they're very they're, they're very prone to getting abscesses. An abscess typically happens because they get a puncture wound from another cat's nail. Cats are magnificently adapted to have really sharp claws, which really make their point. Um, but the problem is they're, they, they heal really well. So in a lot of cases, these guys, guys get a puncture wound and then the, hit, the skin heals around it so quickly that it, it closes that bacteria inside. After a couple of days, you'll typically see this swelling. They typically have a fever. It's typically uncomfortable. And if you don't get them an antibiotic, quick enough, it will continue to develop and then at some point it will abscess and it will drain and you will have an open infection on the side of the face. If that happens, we typically recommend you keep a warm compress with some sort of, you know, cleaning solution. My preference is to never use hydrogen peroxide, but to just use warm washcloth and do warm compresses to help draw that infection out. The other thing that's really helpful is an antibiotic. So this guy is going to get an antibiotic injection, a non-steroidal injection, and some sub-Q fluids to help bring his fever down and to help resolve this infection. If the infection is not gone, meaning if this abscess continues and stays um, stays with them, then sometimes we put a drain in. So we'll actually put it put an opening around the, around the infection infection and put a drain in so that it can drain faster. Some of these cats, I don't know why it's always the orange male cats, but some of them just have these chronic facial wounds and they can take forever to heal. So don't be um, lackadaisical about it. Make sure that you're really proactive and get them on an antibiotic ASAP. I have had one cat who had an abscess that was the side of the face and he ended up sloughing the whole side of his face. We had to do reconstructive surgery because that skin was so dead from being so chronically um, infected. If you have an abscess or any questions about abscesses in cats or what you can do at home or how you can help manage it, you can find me at Jarrett's or Polly.com. Take care. Bye.